Hi everybody, thank you so much for tuning in and welcome to the home of all things FIFA career mode. There is nothing more annoying in career mode than getting the sack after several seasons with the same club and building yourself a decent squad. So should you find yourself in that position or whether you just fancy moving clubs by browsing the jobs available, why not take the best players from your current team with you? So prior to getting your contract terminated by your current employer, go into the squad hub and give every player that you want to take with you to your new team a £1 release clause. But just be aware if you wasn't going to get the sack prior to giving all the top players a £1 release clause, you'll definitely get the sack afterwards. Sadly if you get the sack in career mode, there will be only one job opportunity available. However if you decide to browse jobs, you should have a few more options. Once you've taken over at your new club, it's then time to shortlist all the players that you gave a £1 release clause to from your former club. And then it's a simple matter of paying that £1 transfer fee for every player that you gave a release clause to. And then once you have negotiated the contract with the player and his agent, you should have got yourself a bunch of highly rated top players for under a tenner. So using this career mode as an example, I've taken revenge on my former club by signing all their best players for a combined total of £5 plus wages. And those players include an 85 overall Pierre Duomo, an 87 overall centre back Nemandi Collins, a 91 overall Shola Shortier, a 93 overall Dane Scarlett, but the best of all is a 94 overall Wahid Fagir. So the next time you're facing the sack in career mode, why not jump ship and take the best players with you? Thank you so much for watching this video. Please remember to tune in next time, but until then, it's FCG out.